Good day, Tinkercad friends. I am in the mood for a new design, and today's design is going to be a butterfly. If you're interested in creating one, you can follow these simple steps to make your own butterfly as well. I like to name my files so that way I don't lose them. And then I'm going to start by making my butterfly's wings, and I want them to be two millimeters thick. So I'm going to just click the box and type two and press enter. And I'm totally going to freehand this little fella. I am not going to really plan it. So I'm going to stretch that piece that way. I'm going to do control D to make a second one. And I'm going to bring it down and I'm going to make it a little bit wider. So there I've got my two pieces of butterfly wing, both two millimeters thick. When I take those and I group them, you'll see that it kind of looks like a butterfly's wing. I want to put some cool little hole shapes on my butterfly, so I'm going to just grab the cylinder hole. I'm going to make it any custom way that I want. I'm going to make it three millimeters uh, thick so that it uh, is sticking out a little bit and is easier to grab. Then I'm going to stretch that back out. And then I'm just going to place that and duplicate it. I'm going to zoom in so I can see these parts that I'm grabbing. I'm going to spread it out. Once I get it to a new spot, I'm going to change it to a new size because I want the holes in my butterfly's wing to all be unique. Make another one over here, shrink it to whatever size I feel like. Do control D to duplicate, bring that one out, set it where I want. Do control D and I'm going to put one more up here. I want to make it, I'm um, going to scroll in. I want to make it thinner. I'm going to stretch it this way as well. So there I've got what I think looks like a cool butterfly wing. I'm going to grab it. I'm going to group it. And boom, I've got a pretty nifty looking butterfly wing. I'm going to do control D to duplicate that. I'm going to use the awesome flip tool to flip it. Now I've got two butterfly wings. I am going to align them at the top point here then I want to rotate both of them and I'm gonna rotate them 22.5 degrees because I think that'll be pretty cool for printing I need to raise them up and I'm not doing any math I'm just raising them up I'll do the math in a minute once I've added the butterflies body I'm gonna make the butterflies body out of a sphere when I drop the sphere in the middle, I'm going to choose a custom thickness that feels right to me. Once again, no measuring on this guy. I'm just having fun building. I haven't messed with colors yet, but I can. I'm going to take the two wings and I'm going to group them. And then I'm going to grab everything on our canvas and I'm going to line it so that it's centered. And I'm going to call my little butterfly done and I'm going to try printing them. So let me see how cool your butterflies can turn out and let's see what they look like when we 3D print them. And thank you for following along.